is this ultra set team, sometimes known as the team ultra set team. Here I'll show you a quick tutorial on how to use Brawly in the DBZ tribute game for Warcraft 3. The strategy I'll be doing is a simple hell rush. You want to click and drag over where he's going to spawn, and then just right click, bring him down to the bottom left. In between the two sets of trees, you'll see a row. Have him going to attack the row. Unfortunately, I didn't do it early enough there. If you do it early enough, you get a view to the right of the trees as well. When the rogue's down to about half health, the other one will be close enough that you can just hit them both with your uh, arrow ability. That is power level rising. You want to, until you die, always get power level rising. You want up to level 5. So I'm just going to draw that guy, head up. And there'll be a large level uh, six, 12 droid over here. Use R, run away from him. Just going to chain him for a bit. And again, okay, now be very careful not to hit that ramp I just showed you with your our ability. Uh, you're going to be stuck down here. I've done that in a game once or twice, it's not fun. And yeah, don't worry about your mana too much. Um, even if you hit R every single time you can, I'm pretty sure you'll still have mana left over and be able to finish this. So. Okay, you pull both these. Now, the next step, you want to hug the left wall on your way up, or else you're not going to pull one of the turtles. The right direction, and it'll be a little slow. That one up there usually gets pulled downward and comes all the way around the long way, unless you hug that wall really closely. So, and then when they all get close, just come up out again. Pretty simple pattern. Now, this puts you up to level 10 in a little bit. Now go pull both of these guys over here and let them kill you. Try not to kill them because then your health and stats and everything will go up and yeah, it just doesn't work usually. If you find a way to do it, be my guest and tell me about it in the comments or something. Grab the boot, don't pull the guys on the right because you're not killing any of these small mobs. If you want to get level 20 by Fast Saga, you do things a little bit better than I did and kill the small mobs, but oh well. If you don't hit them one shot with your uh, arrow ability right there, but you do hit that one. So Now that you killed those, you're going to want both your revive and destruction for your level 1. That will give you spells, um, power level rising, level fur, destruction fear 1, and um, same determination 1. Now, if there's a Z fighter down here, kill them first and then the saga. Your goal is to reach 20 without dying here. I could just me light up the Sibian men a little bit earlier instead of going all the way around, but okay. So, when you hit 20, you get your first upgrade, which is two time, well, 1.5 times stats. And that will just let you destroy. But make sure you pick up the log first. I missed it here by accident. It looked like my guy went first, but he didn't. I picked it up afterwards, though, so it's all good. And right here is where you'll see maybe Goten and Trunks running around, Piccolo. Just pick off a stray Z fighter. If you get lucky, they'll have the Senzu Bean. You can save that for after turtles where you're a little bit weak. Up and around here, you usually also see a Z fighter. Usually, a nose Vegeta or something running around. Sometimes it's worth it to pop your head into the tower and see if there's anyone immediately there. Sometimes there is, and it can be really worth it. Now, if you notice, probably some of those characters, you don't really need a chain ass. Like, you do if you want to do some stabbings of him, but for his main one, 
you're really just killing things too quickly to chain them anyway. He's a lot like Future Trunks that way. Now, Raleigh's next upgrade is at 3.5, he can go Super Saiyan, but his Super Saiyan gives him 2.5 stats, making it the earliest 2.5 stats you can get in the game. Besides possibly Cell, but I'm not going to count that because he has to go search for Android, which takes oh, almost a year or two of real life time. Unless you get lucky. So, that there's my usual Tails chain. If you do it that way, Tails gets stuck behind your mob, and you can just blast them from afar. As probably you want to let them get a little bit closer first. But basically, the goal there is to keep them separated and unable to harm you. So, and that puts you to level 35, which makes you pretty much invincible. Let me just power up the rising. There you go. Now. One of the key things to note about playing Raleigh is you should constantly be hitting Sagas or Z Pipus. Since he doesn't chain as well as the other characters in the game, like Goku and Cell, he won't keep up late game unless you're in Hell. In Hell, it's a different story. You level up fairly quickly in there. I'm not exactly sure why, it just works out really well for characters like Raleigh. But since you don't want to be dead the entire game and you have a lot of power in there, don't waste yourself, go out there, kill Sagas, kill Z Fighters, keep them down, have Mad Cool of Sense if he's around. And boom, you get Wheelo. Yeah, same determination is a really great spell. And uh, remember to keep 500 mana safe the entire game, especially if there's Z Fighters around. I didn't during the Saiyan Saga. Whoops. Oh well. Um, but. If you uh, do, if long the same determination is up and you have 500 mana, you will not die. Okay, so over here you have the droid spawn, medical spawn, and up here this counter, and then down over here. This is around where Bobby is, right on the future. And then once again around the lookout. Okay, all those spots are where your sagas are going to tend to flock to. Um, each one for different reasons. If there's someone in the future, he'll go over to the one by droid. Well, the one by uh, Bobby and droids. He'll go to the one by droids if they're not playing and are just staying around the base, even when they are playing. And then, yeah, medical. You've probably seen that for obvious reasons.